The road is expected to be constructed from Ogle on the east coast of Damarara to Great Diamond on the east bank of Damarara. This will be stage two of the project, with stage one being the completion of the consultancy services for the design, which was done by Rights Limited, an Indian public sector company, at a cost of 1.3 million U.S. dollars. According to the government ministry, based on submissions thus far, the approximate budget for construction of the road is 104 million U.S. dollars. In March, March 2016, the Ghana government inked a loan of 50 million US dollars with the Export Import Bank of India for the construction of the 20 kilometers bypass road. The new road will serve to reduce the congestion by providing commuters with an alternative route, thereby improving the safety and comfort of commuters. It will also allow commuters to navigate around the outer limits. It is expected that the travel time between East Bank and Georgetown will be reduced, thereby by creating significant savings for commuters. Currently, the East Bank Highway is the only exit route available to residents who occupy Georgetown, East Coast Damarara, and the East Bank of Damarara. It was noted that the design will allow for the integration with the existing road network via a number of connector roads at Aubrey Barker, Higgs Bosch, Mocha Arcada, and Diamond Access Roads. The proposed design for the main alignment comprises of three sections. Between Rupert Craig and Railway Embankment will have four lanes with a cycle lane on each side and covered concrete drain which will be used as a sidewalk. The government of Ghana has also approved the consultancy services for the continuation of this project, that is from Diamond to Suzdijk, which will also commence in 2019. Reporting for the newsroom, Fariza Hanif.